pretty much how the game goes, right? The child with the knife needs help, we help the child with the knife. Lulu's consultation. As you begin to look for Lulu, you hear a, near a voice nearby. I can remember to grab uh, the mushroom. Will you hear me out? Sure, make it short. Like everything about you, hey ho! What do I get? Sure. Good, let's get started. I don't... There you are, Lulu. I don't want to be in the bath with the child. I'll be waiting outside. I paid you, so don't let anyone in. I know. Thanks. It's quiet now. Was that a bribe? Thanks. Why would we thank her? Was that a bribe? They can be very useful. Now let's talk. I'm actually looking for something, and... I want to get your opinion on it. So... I'm looking for the soul key. It's just like the demon keys that you've been looking for, but much, much worse. <laughs> because this one is the Archangel of Darkness Souls key, the head of all demons. Archangel, angle, angel, head of all demons, is he a bad guy? The Archangel of Darkness, I mean... That's right, he's the strongest dark being on the face of the planet. If a demon were to get his get its hands on this key, soul would be revived. And then something really bad would probably happen around here. Someone important told me to get this key before anyone else does. That's why I wanted to ask you. Do you happen to have anything that might actually be the soul key? Nope. I'll look for it. Look for it? Who stops in mid-sentence and looks you in the eyes? It's no use. If I couldn't find it, neither could you. You were... We're gonna drown this child. I just thought you might have it. Seems like you're telling the truth. Our talk ends now. A little bit. Like, you don't have Hello. to... Hello, you two. As soon as you leave the bath, you're met by Lazarum. He has probably been waiting. Hmm. I, Lazarum Rantiel, heard everything you were talking what? about. What is this all about, Barber? I am not a barber. <laughs> and what do you mean? You just told me not to let anyone in. You didn't tell me not about not letting anyone eavesdrop. See you later. Oh, I fucking ran. Damn, Damn child. So, what does he want to say? <laughs> I thought this would be a good opportunity for me. Will you drop by my shop sometime? You can give up looking for your thing after that. Damn your dirty shop. No, no, no. Are you sure about that? Just because it's dirty? In that case, OAG, make sure Lulu makes it to my shop. Okay. Your room is dirty. You kidding me? Yeah, what? I don't like. Why are you bossing around? Your room is dirty. Damn it, not you too. Anyways, I'm going, I'm going back there now. You are a karma. I'm going to get real mad. Lulu looks up at your face. I guess we have to go. He's on the third floor. I'll meet you there. I'll see you later. Yeah, we know where he is, buddy. There you are. Let's get inside. I knew you two would come. Let's get going already. What? Huh? Where to? He just told us to come by your shop. Hmm. A wise man always conceals some of his talent to fool his enemies. Now come on! No, oh, welcome. Excuse me. <laughs> Excuse me. Whoa. What are you guys doing? Shoplifting? Just listen to me, Castle. Lulu here is looking for something, so naturally OEG asked me to help her out. Wait, 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 hold on. Shut up, you stupid elf. Tangled for you. Hey, what's going on here? Well anyway, I'm gonna search this shop. He said that like it's nothing. Excuse me. Lazirum hops, hops the counter and tries to walk to the back of the shop. Oh. Wait, get the hell out! Let me go. Don't you want to do something nice for Lulu? Huh? I don't give a shit. Well, since we're already here, we might as well check. Hey. Oh gee, don't just stand there watching. Help! Stop Lulu, pretend not to hear him. Help Lulu. I guess we're just gonna pretend not to hear him. You play dumb. Damn you. 
Just then, Castle's pendant falls out of his pocket. Who picks it up? N no, not that. I see. Lulu thoroughly examines the pendant. Then Kozen gives it back to Castle. This isn't it. It's just a cheap pendant. Is it important to you? Yeah. You should hold on to it. It won't get you much money. Hey! <laughs> so, Lulu? Did you find the soul key? The soul key? It's not here. That's too bad. Sorry for dragging into this, OAG. You can just forget about what we talked about for now. And then go do some more research. See you later. Goodbye. What's my reward? Give me something. Let's get out of here and talk over some tea, OAG. Wait. Hold it. You don't think you can just leave now, do you? <laughs> this is precisely why I don't like idiots. Don't you get a castle? In the long run, it's better to... Hey. Hey, you see that flail and mace over there? Y yeah, what about them? Choose one of them. I'll let you choose which one you want up your ass. Well, there you go. Good work. <laughs> Panade told me everything. Things seem to be getting better. She almost cried. I heard some things. Finally. <sighs> yeah, it took quite a while. But Panade is back to normal, so I'm happy. That should brighten up the mood around uh, the inn to how it used to be. And when I think about my mission, I start to get depressed. I want to have fun with everyone who lives here. Which I haven't told you about my mission, have I? My mission is to prevent Sol, the Archangel of Darkness, from reviving. That's it. The reason I'm having you capture demons is to prevent Sol's revival. If the demons can get Sol to manifest, something really bad will happen. Sol has the potential to become the ultimate god of evil. Although, that may still take many years. If things stay the way they are now, it won't happen right away. Anyway, my mission is to prevent these things from happening. Do you get it now? Sounds noble, let me figure I figured. Yeah, sure, why not? <laughs> Thank you. You know, the one who's going to do the heavy lifting in this fight is you, Demon Gazer. Don't forget that. I'm gonna change the subject now. Hey. What do you think of Lulu? <sighs> She's scary, yeah. What the fuck? Scary that little girl? She has a knife! Are you interested in her? No! Yeah, no, not really. It's okay. You don't have to hide it. It doesn't bother me. Well, anyway, I need to give you the demon key. Thank you. Here's the key I promised you. Neptune's cool. I think she also... Does she also give me... Yeah, my health is just by... It increases my health just passively. And then I can use this to heal every turn, I believe it is. Which is kind of cool. Right now I take 30% physical damage. Just as is. Which is nice. Her, she increases 40% of my physical damage, which is also nice. So I want to throw her on for my third slot, which is level 20 or 18. Or, this is your fifth demon. That should be all the demons outside of the Grimadora Castle. Congratulations. Good work. This is a big step. That being said, you need to get inside Grimadar. There's only one problem. You may know this already, but Grimadar Castle doesn't have a gate. Apparently there used to be one, but it crumbled over time. Now, on top of that, it's protected by a spell. <sighs> Whoever cast it knew their stuff, but there has to be a way. Try doing all the quests on the bulletin board for a while. You might find a hint there. Alright, so now it's mimic time, I assume. Uh, what's my items looking like? No, no, no. Discard. I have some water underwear to put on. Sure. Put it on. Uh, yo, right? Five more, sure. I'll have to find better underwear for everybody. Oh, actually, wait, did he have counter? What? He does have counter. What's going on now? Break time. Chaos. We're here to kill chaos. Nice. How's it going over there? 
damn it. Don't tell me you're going to do this quest. Yeah. They're called the Three Treasures. While Grimadar was still flourishing, it was owned by the Lord of the Area. It's one of the items every mercenary dreams about finding, but none of us have been able to make the dream come true. Huh? Huh? You guys? Not too bad over here. We've been playing around. Uh, we got stepped on by Neptune. Initially, she had a fin, but then she switched and had feet. So that was better. <laughs> Are you too interested in this quest? No, no, I gave up a long time ago. Oh, it's just you, OAG. Better once. What do you have for food? That's fine. Okay. Anyway, do you have some time on your hands? Castle says as he drags you to his shop. And then? So, do you already know about it? This quest is really easy. All you have to do is find the King's Ring. It was made about 200 years ago when this area was still a rich mining land. The sword, shield, and ring make up the three treasures. It is said that the Lord of Grimadar Castle ordered them to be made, but you see, the people really love the sword. He abused the people. He got hooked on magic and ordered them to build a weird tower. He was just a really bad lord, and no one really liked him. He eventually died a mysterious death, and that was the end of his royal family. Seeing how this area looks now, the story seems to be true. Oh, I got majorly sidetracked. If you find the ring, please bring it back to me. If it's a real deal, the prize will be all yours. I know I made it sound really easy, but there's a reason most mercenaries gave up on this quest. This is really giving me a headache. Well, I'll go into more detail when I find it. That's about it. You have any questions? Can I have the ring? Huh? Throw oh, I didn't tell you? Yeah. yeah, you can have it. If you find it, you can keep it. I can't really use it anyway. You should hold on to it. Nope. Okay. All Good there is luck. to it. Good luck. Oh, it's the monster. That's not very nice. Are you interested in that quest? Wait. I'm gonna go get the manager. And so... Manager, over here. Well, watch your step, please. I'm not a little kid. Sorry for the wait. I came out here, but I don't have much to talk about. The quest is you defeat the mimic. It's a monster that wandering around the castle. A lot of the mercenaries are asking for someone to defeat it. Did you talk about where it appears? N no, not yet. Yes. Okay, then tell him. <sighs> okay. Um. The mimic is usually found in the star curtain. I don't know exactly where, but you should check it out. So that's the deal. The other mercenaries are paying for this quest, so the pay is good. It sounds intriguing, doesn't it? Once you defeat the mimic, let the mercenaries in the hall know. All right. I have no idea how this is going to go, but probably fine. Maybe. It has to be better than the last time. Can I go three screens? Do they let me do that? Oh, it's the goddamn Mantis is back there. I see you. Oh, actually, good amount of experience. Hold on. I do all my buffs. We get... Force Magic. Force Hit. Force Avoid. And Whistle. Good. And then... Yeah, up here. Some birds. It's fine. I'll probably get to my level ups actually on the way over. Hopefully. I wish I could just warp there, but this is kind of a close second, you know? Let me swan, do your shield, please. Thank you.
Give me the Wishmer. Fluffy bed. Pretty close to level. Come on. Hate the maps. I want to get slashed too already. I mean, we go into another dungeon, so possibly open up those artifacts. There we go. More agility. More vitality. 45 health, sure. More luck. We got parry. That's cool. More mysticism. Enhance heal? I think that's a passive. Mm. Alright, nothing can go wrong. Everything can only go right, right? You find a mysterious chest. Of course we're going to open it. What could go wrong? Put your hands on the chest, and suddenly... The ground below disappears. How far did you fall? You slowly open your eyes. It's a cool ass looking boss. And find yourself inside an organism. You encounter something. It Mars out? Probably? This guy had an annoying, like, I have to... I don't miss skills. I don't think he does... Mm. Always hit. Not doing anything. Not to kill those, probably. Actually, let's see if I can just slow him. Good. I don't want to waste my triple attack on that, you know. Alright, mess him up. Oh, I need to get the... Right. <laughs> oh, come on. I hate that it... Oh, actually, I almost took down half its health? Okay. That's cool. I don't know what he's weak to. It did no damage. 
I know he is. Oh, 400, come on. I gotta get the hide going on him, but he's gonna be... He's gonna see him again, you know? It sucks to waste a turn. He's not really doing any damage. What's going on, Cerebi? How are you doing today? Fucking... Excuse my language. Okay, you suck. So I'm just going to... Aw. No bueno. Chaos exists. I don't see anything important. Ouch. That's not a good one. Wait, did it say she tried a formation change? No, 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 no. We keep whistle on. You're not changing my formation. Oh, he doesn't have a lot of health back there. I'll join for this. Green booty. Uh, made booty. Alright, blit. Dead. This fight was so difficult when if you fight it at like level 10. Remember the hell you first can? I did. I'm trying to think. I might have been 30 minutes and then I lost, but I was super close. And then it took me another 30 minutes the next time and I actually beat him. This is a little lackluster when you go back two bosses later. Or three bosses later, however it is. Get a Midgard Tooth. I think it's actually a, a cool sword. You and your party escape the monster, accompanied by a loud shriek. Oh, hell yeah, I won. My name is Hemi Chan. <laughs> Sorry, Em. You make it out safely. You see something falling from above. A mysterious treasure chest lands before you. Upon closer inspection, you can see it has five keyholes. Crazy. I didn't think you'd be able to defeat the mimic. You're amazing. Thank you. Demons are crazy. Anyways, I'm glad that the mimic is out of the way now. Right. I know, right? I'm sure the manager will be really happy about this. Can you get back there now? See ya. We'll open it. I have all the- wait, why aren't we opening it? Oh, you banana head. <sighs> Big guard tooth. Yeah, it's a cool sword. Poison, and beast strength. 92. Why would I not use this? Although... Could get poison on them too, then we get poison and paralysis and everything. Alright, you can put that on. Wait, does that mean I get an upgrade on you? Yeah, I'm fine. Uh, actually, no, 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 because it takes my damage. So I, I kind of do need a stronger thingy. I need more agility though. Uh, let's get this shit out. Yep. Oh, hey. Can you pay the rent? 600. Uh-huh. Thanks. I'll see you around. It's crazy, lady. Hold on. I got to find the working one. Trying to set up where I don't have to have the emotes, you know? There we go. You haven't owed me for money in quite a while. That's wonderful. I wish every resident would follow your example. Here's a gift to celebrate your timeliness. Oh, we got the Fran figure. Soft. Small figure of Fran. Congratulations. <laughs> I 
Even better. Uh, now, is it good furniture? I mean, it's six mysticism. Emmy Swang gets the, uh... Perfect. My willingness to help depends solely upon how much or how many can't grow pills you're going to pay me in. Don't make this weird. That's Those are my rates. Now let's see if I can uh, fix... Yeah, I don't care. Now, can I strengthen these? No, no, no. Equipped. You. How are you? Cost 60? Really? You bitch. <laughs> it's too much. Alright, we gotta go. Uh, probably you? I want you to keep living here. I'm sure many people will disagree with the decision, but what happened to Lorna was just an unfortunate incident. I need you. Please continue to lend me your power. I forgot to give the mushroom to the cat. You had one job, ghost. I'm lashing out, I'm sorry. Are you maybe gonna help me look for mushrooms? Thank you. I thought you, maybe you wouldn't. You're a good person. Give her the mushrooms. Ooh, mushrooms are the best. Um. This is your reward. Thank you. We got cat powder. It's actually pretty good. Please come back with more. Thank you. Oh, it's the monster. I know why you're here. It's about the mimic, right? Wait. And so. <sighs> Sorry about the wait. So, are you sure the OEG defeated the mimic? Right. We were watching. Yes. Okay, that's confirmation enough. Thank you. Here's your reward. Two grand's a lot. The area around the castle should be safer now. Keep up the good work. I'm counting on you. I thought hey. I did the... Hey, OG, wait up. Are you talking about the King's Ring? Come to my room when you have some time. That's all. See you later. Hey! I've been waiting for you. Sorry, but can you wait a second? The notes I took on the mimic should be around here somewhere. Oh, here it is. I'm starting to think I'd lost it. Let's see. What was it again? As looks down at the piece of paper. All right, I remember. According to the mercenaries, I heard that there are five keyholes on the chest that came out of the mimic. This corresponds perfectly with the legend of the King of the Rings. According to the legend, there were five seals on the King's ring. Therefore, in that very chest lies the King's ring. So, is this starting to get interesting, or what? And guess what? There's more! The ring is supposedly protected by an Attendum God or an Evil God. I think that this part is talking about a demon. So yeah, all this talk about demons and keyholes should be familiar to you, right? That's right. I'm pretty sure that in order to open the chest, you'll need demon keys. So you're gonna need five. I don't know how many keys you have, but if you can, please try to check out the chest. I'm sure it'll be worth it. You're this close to get in the ring. Uh, do I gotta go back to the area? I have five! Hey. You came here to talk, right? The ring is probably in the chest. Inside that mimic. Yes, 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 yeah, 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 yeah. Good luck. Oh my bob. <laughs> so let's see how this works out. So the fun thing is, I think this is the really obscenely hard fight. Or 
Are my characters leveled? They're all leveled. What could go wrong? Run back to the same area for another time? Sure. I forgot to put on the buffs. It's fine. Nothing here should bother me. Yeah, we'll see. Well, this game doesn't really make sense to me, so it's kind of like I either win or I don't. Which I guess is true about a lot of games, but... It's much less me, I'm like, I'm super confident I can take this fight. The more I hope I can take it. You had shit to do. Oh, my Bob. What's with this encounter rate? I need repel. Those are force battles. Like, I, I get that. But the other ones, not so much. Actually, maybe I'll... Mm. There, you get more of the bread. Stop, stop, stop. Uh, no, no, no. Which one of these... Is there any of these close? I can't get to that that easily. And that one's not easy. Oh, no, I can get this one pretty easily. Yeah, that's not that bad. I'll go kill this thing. Which I gotta add all my buffs. But I'll do the uh, the little farming circle, so I can steal a save point. Eventually, I don't think we get anything useful, but you never know. You. Samurai Katana is new. Alright, let's see. We have... I have Whistle Up. I have Whistle Up. It shows on the top part of the screen. You'll see the top right. It'll be those four now. And then... Oh. It's weird. Like, should I throw on the healing girl? And get rid of the damage one, or hope the damage one helps and kind of turtle myself. Hmm. Alright, what's the katana look like? 2 times 36, and it's dead. I mean, it's kind of cool. I don't... Dead will work on uh, Slash. So I guess it's good for... Trash. Because I ain't getting a level anytime soon. Oh, my Bob.
But I believe this is about the halfway point of the game. Everyone's healthy, everyone has mana. I have my four buffs up. I don't know what the foot one is. Oh, the foot one on the top is from the other characters. It's fine. You find a mysterious chest lying there. If this is the chest with the ring, Castle Leaves Demon Keys will open it. Will you insert keys? Sure. What could go wrong? The Comet Key. Mars. Kronos. Hermes. And Neptune. You insert five keys, and then... From the chest, out comes a small ring. Alright, I guess that was it. Cool thing is you can put on the ring. Spell attack, spell defense, spell everything. This is nice, a little bit of everything. Who deserves this ring? I probably should put it on him. Spell attack and spell... I mean, spell attack is obviously wasted on him, but... Spell defense and spell... A special defense is pretty cool. Spell attack, I guess, would be best on her. King's ring seems suitable for you. Alright. Why not? I'll allow it. Alright, let's get out of here. Now auto saving. What could go wrong here? Hey, can you pay the rent? You're damn straight there's a boss coming. Yes. I'll see you around. Probably. Huh? <laughs> hey, what's up, OEG? You look tired. So, any news on the ring? Ready for a surprise? Perfect timing. <laughs> Ready for a surprise? What? No way, did you? You tell Castle that you got the king's ring. R really? W where is it? Show it to me. You give Castle the king's ring. Whoa. This is the legendary. <sighs> yep, no doubt about it. Here, OEG, I'm giving this back. What should we do now? Castle starts pacing back and forth. Hmm. Alright, let's test it out. No. No, that's a terrible idea. Manager, I need to tell the manager. Whoa. I need to calm down. Be cool as ice. Always you relax. Take deep breaths. I'm fine. You relax. Punch him. I don't I don't want to punch him. There's no reason to. I see. Really? I should just act normal. I'm gonna go back to my shop. I need to do some paperwork. I'll meet you there. Thanks. Castle runs back to his shop faster than he's ever ran before. Why was I thinking this was like the important part of the game? Maybe I'm wrong. I think it took me 26 hours to beat the game. Alright. We strengthen the ring. Ooh. One defense. Yeah, it's not that important. I like my gazer chain. High leather undies. I mean, all right, we give you one, two. Probably could level up the spear, but... Meh. Yeah! Yo, it's good to see you. I'm ready. Alright, let's go. Just you wait, manager. Huh? What? Can you enter Grimadar Castle? Alright, you're all leaving. Are you sure? Yeah. I have no doubt. I've been researching that place for a long time. You can trust me. I should know this. Let me organize everything. Grimadar has been exactly 
has been exactly the same for 200 years, which was back when this area was really rich in mines. Yes. That's right. There was a magical metal mine underneath the castle. Yes, a mithril mine. You would think the Lord would have used the money to live leisurely. I don't know what got into him, but he built an eerily huge clock tower. They say he got way into magic, but no one really knows. So how can we get into the castle? Whoa. What are you doing here? What? Huh? I'm here to change the bed sheets. Go on. Mm, yeah. Right. Eventually the castle collapsed and, well, that's not important. The problem here is the reason the king's ring was created. The one OAG got? Yep. There's a lot of evidence that the Lord got overly attached to magic, such as the magical mirror and the gate stones. It's said that he had those made to increase their mining efficiency. But the ease of travel turned out to be a double-edged sword. All that traffic made it hard to guard the treasure in the castle. It's it's like always leaving the door to your house wide open. So the Lord came up with a plan. He wanted to set up a barrier to protect the whole castle. I get it now. So the ring deactivates the barrier. You can tell from that? Anyway, basically the ring was a free access pass to the castle. Meaning if you have it, OAG, you can get into the castle. Uh -huh. Oh, I see. Jeez. Where are you all coming from? Looks like I need a barrier too. <laughs> I thought you'd show up. May I ask a question? If such a barrier exists, then how could the second incident have happened 10 years ago? Good question. Second, the second incident? What? You don't know? That's when demons started appearing at the castle. If there is a barrier, then the second incident could have never happened. Don't you think it's a bit strange? No. It's not strange at all. It's actually pretty simple. The barrier was off at the time of the second incident. The culprit, whoever they were, was easily able to get into the castle. But something happened there that triggered the barrier and the demon infestation. If you think about it, it makes sense. Yeah. Right. I understand your reasoning, but how can you be so confident about it? What? Huh? Well, because, logically speaking, that phrase doesn't suit you. All right. Damn it, I know that. A anyway, can I borrow OAG for a while? I want to see if he can make it into the castle with the help of the ring. Okay. Sure, that's fine. You can borrow him, so let's do this. Anyone want to ask me? Yeah, I'm not property. Don't get mad. This just goes to show how vital you are to all of us here. So, what do we need to do? Just follow me. It's simple, really. How far are you going to go? Are you going outside? Jeez, you guys don't know. You guys don't all have to come, too, you know. I'm not going outside. This is what I need. Castle points at the magic mirror. The magic mirror? According to the legends, the owner needs to use a certain mirror. So basically, the King's Ring changes the destination to the magical mirror. You probably don't need to put it on, but you can always carry it with you. That's clever. If that is the case... Grand looks intently into the mirror. Huh? What's wrong, manager? I'm probably just thinking too hard. Oh gee, get ready to go. In order to defeat the other demons, you'll need to go into the castle. This invisible castle wall is something we'll eventually need to conquer. Come get me when you try it out. Select talk at the entrance to use the ring. Hmm. Unfortunately, we are going to have to wait until tomorrow to see what talking to this ring does.